wheel drive it. Welcome to Checkpoint One. You are? Jack. So this is it, huh? Well, congratulations on first place for Checkpoint One. Mr. Davy, we've got a Mr. Jack in the restaurant. First place. Si, senor. Will do. He'd like to congratulate you on your first place win. Yeah, sure. So Davy owns this place? See, si. He's owned it for many years. For the winner. And once all the other drivers are here, Lunch will be served. Okay? It's your girl, Six Speed Nina, and I am here at El Tesoro Escondido in the town of Hermosillo, and it's our first stop in the Outlaw 1000. And you better believe I'm gonna be chowing down on some bean burritos before our race moves to our next stop, Puerto Panesco. Can I ask you what the hell you're doing? Well, I'm posting to all my followers on Instagram. You know, checking in every stop of the way, letting him ride shotgun all the way to L.A. Or letting the cops know where we're going all the way to L.A. You don't want to go around broadcasting where you're going unless you want to get pulled over and arrested. The Mexican police don't follow me. Well, they will be before long. Says here, you retired. Like three years ago. And the last time you won something was longer than that. So what's Davey inviting you for? Your guess is as good as mine. But when I buzzed you back there, you didn't know what to do. So you don't have any street reflexes whatsoever. But I guess that's the difference between racing in a closed track against a clock versus having another man in the next lane. Is that right? Let me guess. The real skill comes from doing 90 in a pedestrian zone and losing control and plowing into a family who's coming home from having ice cream. Is that how you hone your street reflexes, bro? Watch your mouth, Grandpa. Easy, guys. Easy. 